there's too many things to say about Miss Alexis. <laughs> um, she's my she's my little in my sorority. That's how I met her in Springfield. Um, first, when the first thing I met her, she had big poofy hair, big attitude, um, a lot of personality, which is something that I needed because um, I didn't have a best friend. So, kind of looked looked forward to the times that we had, and we talked about our both of our husbands now are um, agro boys. So we had a lot of stories there, and we had a had a lot of um, interesting evenings. We were roommates for a minute in Springfield, in Republic, close to Springfield, and had a lot of Rummy Bear experiences, drunken Uno, um, which turned into a game. But yeah, lots of lots of fun times. I think she's gonna be a good wife because um, she can cook. I can't cook, <laughs> so that was always a plus having her when we lived together. Um, and she's going to do a lot of fun, spontaneous things because me and her husband, we have similar personalities. We're very structured. We like a plan. Um, but it's, she's going to think of crazy, you know, dates to go on and... Um, I'm trying to think here. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to say. There's a lot. Um, when I think of Alexis, I think of, oh, look, you got me calling her Alexis now. I know, I know her as Nikki. Nikki. When I was Whatever in Fort Scott with her. She introduced herself to me as Nikki. She was my first friend out there. I didn't know anyone, and we worked together at Sharky's, and we have a ton of stories there. <laughs> I won't go into all that. She knows. <laughs> but um, I don't know. She just kind of picked me up one day <laughs> and took me home, and I was always her stray dog. And I have a lot of things that have happened in my life because of her. Um, she's just she's one of my best friends, and I love her. And I think her and Jessie are going to be really happy together. She's definitely a wild country girl, but I think she's right where she needs to be. Mine is probably when she came to a pool party that, that I had back home, and she was feeling pretty good. And she, I was like, I'm going to make you a drink. She's like, okay. And I was mixing Mike's and tequila. And she drank it, and then she proceeded to eat Taco Bell and then puke in my mother-in-law's rosebush that killed. She killed it, so... <laughs> Um, well, we were talking about this earlier, probably one of our more wild nights. We, I ended up getting in a bar fight with myself, and <laughs> she uh, was in the back of the bar puking in a, like, Buddha position, <laughs> and it was just a mess, and, um, oh, Good I don't times. know. There was a time we invented a shot together, uh, the rum chata, the dang rum chata. <laughs> when I think of Nikki, my, the first thing that comes to mind is how she is just so like out there she just has her own style and she uh, she always says work it smoochie yeah. and like I just <laughs> I don't know she cracks me up congrats girl we love you we love you so much don't hate us after today <laughs> when we do our special toast peace was on j-dog <laughs> coming for you here for your entertainment <laughs> when I think about I know her as Nikki so when I think about Nikki I think of fun, free spirit, and up for whatever. You know if she's coming along, it's always gonna be a party. It's gonna be a great time. You're not gonna have a dull moment, that's for sure. <laughs> she's gonna make an amazing wife for Jesse. She, she'll never let anybody be left out. For him, she will always make sure that he is the most important person to her. She would be great for any of us, and I can only imagine how great they are going to have a life and it's going to be great. I would say probably some of our best memories were at Sharky's. We worked together and between there and some really crazy rodeo parties that we've gone to, I don't know how much we remember, but I always knew it was a great time. The first time I met Jesse, I was really intimidated, but that was just because I knew how important he was to Alexis and everything like that. And I, like he had just driven in on his motorcycle and he was super cranky because it was really cold outside. I was like, oh my gosh, I don't want to irritate him anymore. Like I just kind of sat there like, hi, you know, but no, he's really cool and he puts up with a lot, especially for me. And, <laughs> and so I, I tell him he's my best friend and he just kind of looks at me. That's the relationship Jesse and I have. <laughs> <laughs> he's really good for Alexis because he, just like her, marches to his own 
his own drum and does his thing. And I mean, the two of them together, they're just so sassy. And <laughs> I think that they'll keep each other on their toes and keep their minds fresh and young for a very long time. <laughs> Sorry, there's a cat. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, I just think that they will challenge each other to their fullest potential and it'll just, yeah, they're just gonna keep each other going. <laughs> The first time I ever met Alexis, all we did was talk about horses, and I know nothing about horses, but I just know I like them, and, <laughs> and we talked about that forever, but probably one of my favorite memories was, okay, it didn't start out very good, but I got dumped bad, and I was sitting on her couch just crying, and she was like, no, get up, we're going, we're going to go dancing, and so we went to Midnight Rodeo, and that was the <laughs> night I learned how to two-step. <laughs> And it did not go well. <laughs> but, you know, she just kind of kept me going and was like, we're just going to distract you. It'll be fine. And so she really looks out a lot for, you know, everyone's heart. And she takes the time to, like, invest in people. And I think that that's something that's really special. Well, the first time I met her, I was going through recruitment in our sorority. And uh, for, she had the biggest hair I had ever seen. <laughs> and uh, You're welcome. <laughs> Yeah, well, she, I had just finished talking to another girl and she came in and she's like, hi, I'm Alexis. And she was very bubbly and she just had a great personality and she was super sweet. She, and after that, I mean, I knew I wanted her to be my big at, after that. And she, she's been, I like her a lot. <laughs> <laughs> There was something that we didn't go to, but she was like, well, we're going to go on a road trip. So I had no idea where we were going. She just said, dress in some nice jeans and we'll, we'll go. Well, we ended up going to Fort Scott and she showed me around all everywhere and she, it was just, it was a lot of fun. Congratulations, I'm so happy for you guys. Congratulations, you are the most beautiful bride inside and out. And I can't wait to see what your life goes. Congratulations, I'm so excited we get to celebrate with you and I wish you guys all the happiness in the world. <laughs>